Is this not a charm, Madison? Eh? Who is after you? Ichie, nobody is after me. I was just coming to meet you. What happened? I hope all is well. Speak, speak. Ichie, all is not well. Ichie, I was just coming from your house now. Your family members want to kill each other now. You have to hurry home now. What? Again? Is it not what we are just talking? Okay. My son, you are so well. Oh. Ah. What do you have? Hey, 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 I'm begging you! Eh? I, I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for what happened to Nai Bikonu. I wouldn't want people to come here and see you on their floor. This I'm begging you. It will even be better that the whole villagers will come and see how you people push a chair like me to the floor. I'm not going to stand up here hmm. until you bring all the requirements. <laughs> One white goat, two white cocks. Mm -hmm. Three tubers of yam. Hey! And two keg of palm wine. Hmm? Papa! If I will stand up here. You want to open pot three? It looks like yeah. you have to open for market. The annoying part of it. If Bichu. That one of you could give a reasonable explanation for this childish act of yours. Your Majesty. The prince will be with you shortly. Why do you make it a point to disgrace the name of this family every day? Sorry, eh? That is why you don't have hairs here. No single hair. Thank you! Shame Thank you! I like I it more and more like you. this! Shame on you! Shame on you! Hey! Eh? Shame on you! You say Hold it there right now! Hold it! Yes, I'm talking to you! Ashamed of what exactly? I want to ask you! Ashamed of what? You are doing your behavior like this and you are asking me a question! What question is that? Will someone be ashamed of fighting an evil woman and an evil child in our own house? No, I'm asking you! Wait, Tell me! Is it me? You are calling an evil woman. Yeah. You are you, seeing it. You, oh, you think I don't know? Hey, I was say, I say, I say. You think I don't know? I know that you shamed him with your dark powers. And you also make him to take responsibility of this black witch standing here. Wait, 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 wait. Tell, 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 tell. Did I hear you well? You heard me loud and very clear. Yes. Oh, you think I am afraid of you? Oh, you think I'm afraid of these eyes? You think you can share me with them? You have just told a lie. Oh, I say, you have told a black fat white lie. That is what you have just said. Tell me. I'm waiting for you. I am waiting for you. I am waiting for you. Yes, 
I, I, I'm sure you are ready to carry the market you bought for yourself. And, and I'm very sure your daughter has the goods to supply. Hey, come on, come on. Can do. Understand the reason for this argument this morning. What do you want me to say? What else do you want me to say? You don't understand. Now tell me, what is stopping you from proposing marriage to her? Is she not beautiful enough? I mean, why have you not made your intention known to her? That my intentions towards her has no color, no size, no height of any marriage at all. You are very stupid to say that, Anthony. Huh? Is she not beautiful enough? So what have you been doing all this while? Oh. So she's only good at warming your bed, right? Dad, come on. She's been the one jumping on my bed at will. Did you just say that? Let's see. I have to go now. I will see you when I come back, okay? Anthony! Step an inch close to that door. Then I will make you understand why they call me Otigulago. Let's go. Let's go where? You don't know you don't know that much, Jack Papali. Mama, I've checked now. I'm, I'm, I'm sure she did not follow us to this place. How let's can she go. be chasing us to this place of Bonyala? Yeah, sure. Let's go. I'm sure. Okay, let's go. Uh, let's go. Uh, take the lead now. Who? Mm. Me or you? You, yeah. you are younger than me. Let's go. No, Mama, you are my mother. I take the lead. You, you are the oh, elder. Mama, 
You are saying wait. I ask you to check. You are saying wait. What are you waiting for? Wait, Mama! Somebody is coming. Who is that? I don't know. Let me check. Check, check. Let me check, check if she's the one. Come I told you to check. It's him I'm checking. Hey, Mama. She's not the one. Move this Simba. I should move. I'm moving now. You're jumping. You're jumping. Come, let's go. Let's go. Come, follow Mama, me. You are not afraid. Follow me, boy. What are you doing? Hey, 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 I knew it. I knew this girl would be lurking somewhere around here. She even pursued her uncle. Hey! I knew it. Hey! Hey! What's that? Hey! Hey! hey. Mama? What is that? Um, you must be very, you're a very stupid girl. Nothing, no, it's insect. It's, it's, it's insect. <laughs> that is why you want to let my heart skip out of my body. What is wrong with you? Sure. What is sorry? Sure. Eh? I told you, you refused. Speak very well, speak very well. Look at my mother. <laughs> Mama, you are very funny. Do you know that when when someone sees you, the way you fight and talk to people in here, people, they will think that you, you, you are the strongest. Can you even know that? Small girl, just small girl like the bitch can even frighten you. See how scared you, you are. You are very, very stupid. Huh? You are a very stupid girl. Me? I don't blame you. Who told you I'm afraid of small girl? Hey, but come on. A small girl like you pursued your mother here. Instead of you to go and fight, you're talking this nonsense. Okay? Me? Yes, you. She can fight. Ha! Mama Biko Bodoku is there. Don't just include me. How do you expect me to go and fight somebody with axe? Yeah. With an axe? Obabu person now, run your race, I'll run my race. Ha! Huh? You'll be putting it's me into a problem. Huh? Come. I should come. Don't come, stay there. Mama, I'm not coming. We'll run your race, I'll run my race. You may know. Is it not personal? It's personal. Obabu personal, Mama. Obankabu personal. Ah, look at what you've made me go through. I mean, I hide it. I cannot even go to my father's house. Peace. Mama! Come Mama, no, no, wait for me. Mama, Mama, to be quiet. She's coming. Hey! Mama, so you can fear. I'm not fear. I thought she was coming too. Right, let's go. Go, don't worry. I will wait for some time before I go. Eh? You have to wait. Let me tell you. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. She's not coming. Let's go. Eh? Anthony, my son, you will. I can assure you that you will. Look, I have promised. Ukadike, and I am not the man that goes back on his words. Father, those words I will give him without me in the picture, and I will not allow them to make me lose weight at all. Anthony, in case you've forgotten, let me remind you I am the king, and my word is law. You are going to marry Tolia. There's nothing you can do about it. Father, with all due respect, I will disappoint you in this. I am not going to marry Tonya. Yes, I will not marry her. I, I cannot do that just to just to fulfill your agreement with her father, Ukadike. Father, I cannot do that. This is my life. I cannot trade my life for anything. Not even to strengthen the family alliance of the Ukadikes. Anthony, but will you shut up? I said shut up! How dare you? Look, I am the king of kings in this state. I am a first class king in Nigeria. Nobody, nobody ridicules me. Not even you. Now you better get prepared to marry Tonya. If not, you will see the other side of me as the king, the great king that I am.
much You and your daughter are walking in fear. I hope all is well. You are very stupid. You are very, very stupid. Who is walking in fear? And by the way, what is your business? We walk the way we choose to walk. What's your business? I know, Pama. The way you and your daughter are walking is very suspicious. Suspicious, kill you again. Suspicious, as what? I know, Pama. Yeah? They are coming from our compound. Okay? Did you by any means see Nebishi around that area? I saw her in the front of your compound. It's a big ass. But wait, oh. is she the one you and your daughter are afraid of? Yes. You are mad. You must be very Get stupid. Come on, let this person in jump. No, 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 let him wait yes. for me. Let him wait for me in jump. You are busy. You are mad. Mama, 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 wait for me. Don't worry. Leave him. Let's go. We should go. Yes, let's go. I'm off here. Let's go. Eh? Idiot. Mm. Let's go. Yeah. As we are going, be looking, be looking. Yeah. Because Pamela, you'll be the first person to take off. Let's go. Huh? Let's go. Let's go. Hey, Mama, come now, come Mama, back. Let's come. speak. Let's take a walk. What are you saying? You don't know the That is not her. Let's go. Okay. Hey, I thought you are Abu and Why? Not why you are looking scared. What kind of daughter is this? Thank God I ran. What could I have told my ancestor had that axe landed on my head? That I died because of goats and cock. Tufiawa. Tufiawa. Aro. I hope my brother is safe wherever he is now. Boweto. Where did she get all those guards from? I wonder if they gave me the wrong child from the hospital. Mama. Alpha, did you see her? Mama, she's still there, standing like a security guard. Hey! She's not willing to leave there. It means we are not going into my father's house. When that that girl one? is trying me, Amaka. That girl is trying me. I will deal with her. Eh? Yeah, I will, I will grind her. I will scatter her. I will no, mama, 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 mama. Pico, Pico, Pico. Calm down. Calm down, Pico. We've been running for a few hours because of Lebechi. And now you are here talking of what you do to her. Are you not even afraid? Since you know you do something to her, why didn't you do it all this while and save us from this drama and, and this grace and stress of running around the village? Mama, I'm tired. You have to do something, Pico. Amaka, yeah. Mama? come on, let me tell you something. Yes. Yeah. You see, eh? Must you oh! talk like an idiot? Oh, Mama, my ear. Yes. Mama, my ear. Must you talk like an idiot? It is bad enough that you are soft as an agony. Yes. Must you be stupid as well? Uh, Mama, do you have to drag my ear? I will continue drag it. I will drag it from now till the end of the world. Mama, my ear is even paining me. It has not started because I will repeat it around two. I'm not fear. What is it? Mm. Mama, but it's not my fault. I'm not the problem here. It's Nebechi. Yeah. Uh, you have to know what to do to Nebechi and make my father stand up from that ground, though. Me, I'm tired, though. 
your father. Is it, is it even your fault? It's my fault. Uh -huh. It is my fault. Okay. No, no problem. It's not my fault. It's not my fault. Don't worry. <laughs> You're talking about your father, okay? Your father, okay? Let him stay there. From now to whenever he thinks he wants to stand up from there, that is his business. It has nothing to do with me. Huh? Mama? Yes? Ha! Huh. Mbakwa, I have to know what to do to my father to make him stand up from there. Didn't you hear what he said? He said he's not going to live there until he meets his requirements. Amaka, is your father a deity? Mban, I'm asking you. Is your father a deity that I must appease? Answer me! Is he a deity? I must buy goats. I must buy what again? Oil. I must buy what? Cock. Cock. And what again? Unzu. Unzu and the Pamwine. No fear. He will sleep there forever. Mama. What is it? My father is an Ichio. He's an Ichio. And you know what that means? Go and beg him to stand up. Amaka, there's something you don't know. You see that time that Nebeshi took that axe, eh? Your father, fium, he has left. He will never, he will never remain there. Your father is a weakling. He will never remain there. He's as soft, he's even worse off than you. Yes. Yes, than you. Like father, like daughter. Hey. No fear. She gonna meet him. He wants to stand up. Or he doesn't want to stand up. Let him remain there. Mama. He's looking for goat and crayfish and whatever to eat. Let him sleep. Let me ask you something. Mm. Don't be offended. No. Why do you like trouble? You ask me why I like trouble. I will not answer you. Nah. Ah, ah. What is the problem? You, 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 you look worried. What happened? Where's my brother? He has gone. And your daughter? She's outside the gate. You people will hear from me. Nah, he hear from you, Kwa. If there are people that will hear from you, they should be Ngozi and her foolish daughter. Not, not me and my own daughter. Eh, nah. Too much work. I do not finish you. Too much trouble. What can I do? Trouble not a finish you. What can I do? Oh, you know the best. The people who put no canina. Ah, if I don't know, 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 if I Trouble not the finish of a Adapuana. Hey, Jima, if a no canina, if a Pulabu no canina, if a Pulabu no canina, if a no Kata kata, when you're the other two, they can't get out of Google. Has hot war, so blue. I had in the night, I wish you so be careful if I put when any. You can so get up, go blue. Trouble not the finish. Um, Prince Anthony, I can't remember seeing you like this because I know you had a way of dealing with issues like this. Exactly, that's because I can grasp the rationale of my father's will to assert his lordship over me. Yes, and this is no longer funny. Oh. You know that he, he he bottled me to a corner for a long time. I mean, it's no it's no longer funny. Oh, I see. Marrying Tonya here is obviously not the issue. Your father, the king, and his authoritative stance is. I, I, exactly. Exactly. I, I mean, I, I, why would he want to treat me like a child? Huh? Why would he? Um, I couldn't just concentrate at the office today because of this. My friend, I truly understand how you feel. 
but you have to come down so that you can win him over this. I cannot calm down. If you truly understand, you cannot tell me to calm down. Oh no! You're welcome. Thank you very much. So, how did it go? Your Majesty, it was really a tough one. Well, I, I expected that. Uh, I knew it was not going to be a smooth ride all the way. Yes. However, um, what was the outcome? Uh, were you able to convince them? Yes, Your Majesty. Like I said, it was really a tough one. But I was able to convince them. But on the condition that he will sign a treaty that on no account will he sideline them in the future ever again. Fair enough. You see, me, I am willing to do anything and everything for the sake of the royal household and the entire kingdom. Right? Um, I think what you need to do now is to invite their representative so that we can uh, start the process immediately. Right? <laughs> oh, but I was one one of Aquara Kingdom. <laughs> I can see that the, the blood of your late father runs in your veins. <laughs> and wherever he is, we will be proud of what you are doing right now. Ah, that's oh, all. No. Yes. Anyway, thanks for the kind words. Yes. You see, there are three virtues that I uphold dearly. And these are peace, unity, and inclusiveness. They are very high standards that I have set for myself. And I will maintain them at any cost. <laughs> well, this reminds me of the day you ascended the throne of your fathers. And the speech you made and every other thing that followed on that day. <laughs> it was wonderful. Oh, no. ah! <laughs> I saw it. Uh. Hi. Are you going out for it? What does it look like? But you did not touch the food I served you. Which food? Your food. Oh no! <laughs> so you have just proven that uh, your brain is still very active. After so many years, oh, yes. as it was back in those days, <laughs> you can say that again. <laughs> very good. This is the same old Alicia Mecca that you know. Age has nothing to do with the ability of one to remember things. <laughs> Well, um, all you just remembered is a proven testimony that uh, I should uphold my principles. I shouldn't back down on them. So, all that needs to be done have to be done before the offer. Exactly, Igwe. This will offer us an undivided attention in the preparation of this offer land. And you see, this is a good news of my book. Now, talking about your father, what about the crown prince? What about him? Igwe, you know that your son cannot celebrate two offer as a single man. After his enthronement as a crown prince, he has to choose a bride. Whom he must present before the elders, the council of elders, rather, within four months before the father. Oh no, this is actually a big problem for me. 
I've been having a running battle with my son, the prince, for almost a year now because of this issue. He keeps rejecting all my choices of women for him. I mean, it appears his standards are way too high. Igwe, it is not your duty to choose a bride for the prince. Because even your father, the late king, abolished the tradition that the king should not choose a bride for the crown prince. You should allow the prince to choose a bride for himself. Look, Oni, this is not a question of tradition. I know my son very well. He is very hardworking. He's a wise young man. But when it comes to the issue of women, he lacks the capability to choose the right one. Because the kind of woman he needs is someone who can complement uh, his uh, good qualities. Okay? So I, I have um, gone through a whole lot of trouble trying to get a woman that is perfect to complement his good qualities. And I think the one he's dating right now is a perfect one to play that role. You mean he's seen one already? Of course. He's seen one. Um, yeah, she's the daughter of the secretary to the state government. You know, he has gotten the tickets for the next um, governorship election. He's to be our next governor. I see. Then why did he leave? He should go ahead and act fast. To avoid stories that touch. As for the world, if you got one, it's a boo every day. Kata kata, when you're yellow, I'm going to go to the Are you not the one I've been calling since? I've been mean, blind for a year. Yeah, Nebich, please. I am not cut out for your troubles this month. Do you hear me? Please just leave me alone. Oh, you are not cut out for my own sobu this morning. No problem. Yeah, what was that charade you did at the market for? It all depends on what you refer as charade. Do you know? I would advise you to go to that market and sort yourself out with those market people, not me. You look at the women putting out also everywhere. Eh? What Because I'm going to get out of here. Eh? One name. Because. Eh? Like I said, I was actually going to your house before I met you here. Huh? Jello, Jello. Wait. Was this the reason you displayed like a mad person then? Me, mad person. Both of us know who the mad and crazy one is. Mona give me give onyala, onyala yawa. Yeah. What is it again? Is it not too early to make troubles? I what will, is it this time? I will not repeat myself. Chinwe, I will not repeat myself. Who cut my plantain this morning? Your plantain? You heard me. <laughs> Point of correction, my dear co-wife. That plantain belongs to everyone in this family. And if you must know, I needed to prepare plantain porridge for my husband, so I cut it. You can as well take from the bunch if you care. Thunder will fire you dear. Thunder fire you dear, Chingwe. Mbazi. After the disgrace you and your prodigal daughter gave to me yesterday, you still have the guts to go and cut my plantain. And you have the nerves to ask me to take from the bunch. Yes. Because that plantain belongs to everyone, not only you. 
excuse me. I should excuse you. I should excuse you. Okay? Who does excuse me? If you know what is good for you, Tina, go to the market and buy that same plantain and come and replace it. Says me, of course. The only legitimate wife in this house. <laughs> oh, poor, my brother. I understand your anger. Eh? But please forgive me. Eh? Don't make it look as if I planned it. At least you cannot see what your brother is going through in that house. Huh? Even my brother. It is not as if you planned it. I know you did not plan it. But thinking that an Ichi like me will run the way I did like a child in a broad daylight. Saddens me. Uh -uh. It saddens me, Chib. What if that axe has landed on my head? Eh? What just if? But the most important is it did not. <sighs> eh? And please, Okoha, my brother. All I need now is how to stop those madness before it will take me to my early grave. What can I want to What can I want What else can we do? The worst is that they cannot listen to anybody. Hmm? Exactly my point. Exactly my point, my brother. But we need to do something regardless. Biko. You are right, my brother. After all, it's Jim Babuaro. Oh. Mm, we have to do something. Okay. We will do something. Biko, by the way, where are your wives? They were in the house when I left the house. Ah. Yes. Okay. Let us go to your house. from the market. Hey! Why can't you speak now? Huh? My wife, we really want to know where all these problems is coming from. So that we can solve it and put an end to this. Nayokwa, there's no need asking all these questions. We all know that Ngozi is the problem here. She's the only one that touts and pick up fights with me at every opportunity thereby creating the enmity between my daughter and her daughter. So you people should ask her what her problem is. Nene Ajone. Ngozi, you heard what uh, your co-wife said. What do you have to say? Say what exactly? What do you want me to say? You people made me sit down here to listen to this thing with all the nonsense coming from my mouth. Okay? Ngozi, my wife, calm down. We only want to find solution to all these problems oh. so that peace can reign. That's not peace. Peace is what? Where? Come. Excuse me. Which peace are you even talking about? Is it the one that owns that chemist shop at the market square? Or the crippled one at the next village? Listen. Let me tell everyone sitting down here right now. Eh? Hey. 
not until this woman and her child leave this house. There's nothing like peace. Mama! Hey! Mama now! Will you keep quiet? Mama, baby, Shut up! You see, Mama now, baby, 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 what are you, baby? Mama, Mama, you see, you see, you see, Mama, what are you shouting at? Will you do this advice? Stop it! Get inside! I'm not here! Now, Mama, what are you, Mama? It's your boy. You have seen it now. Oh, you have seen what the problem is already. You forgot here. You said it. <laughs> I think I cannot solve this situation. If not now, quarreling cannot solve you. Give a shame on you. Shame, useless man. How many months? Just few months into our marriage, you cannot take care of me. If I go and ask your mates what they do to take care of their wives. All you do is come back to the house with stories every day. You are just a useless man. Even you are so useless. Useless man! Shame on you! Ibe! Where are you going to? Ibe, where are you going to? Come back here! Shameless man! Shame! Shame! It's only a useless man that fights and run away. Come back and meet your wife! You come back and meet me here. I don't even know how I ended up with this kind of a good for nothing man. Rubbish! You come back! You want me to die of hunger? Did I beg you to marry me? Did I beg you to marry me? I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I didn't see you. I'm sorry. No problem. It's fine. But it, if I may ask, why are you always lost in thought anytime you're walking on the road? What is it? Sorry? I don't understand. Okay. The other day I saw you when a bastard could knock you down because you were not looking. And now this. What is eating you up? What is it? Please, I don't know what you're talking about. Please, uh, excuse me. Hey, wait, wait. Sometimes, you might find a brother's shoulder in a total stranger to lean on. My shop is down the road. Free, free. Just come, let's talk. If, if you don't mind. I have heard the story you just said to me and I feel deeply sorry about your situations but why would bad financial issues make a handsome and prospective man like you go through all this? People go through all this and still stand strong. Yeah, I know. But, but, the pressure from my people has become unbearable for me to handle. And the place I work, they are here to reinstate me or pay me what I'm due. I understand. I understand you perfectly, trust me. But what if the bicycle that hit you was a car and gave you a big injury? What are you going to do? Is it going to solve your problems or compound it? I thought as much. Do you okay? You will be fine. You just have to calm down. I live in this compound as well. You're free to visit me anytime you want. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. You're always welcome. So, um, what can I offer you? <laughs> Thank you, I'm fine. Are you sure? Yes. I hope you came back with good news. Is that supposed to be a welcome? Do you deserve a welcome? 
No, Ibe, answer me. Do you deserve a welcome? The money. God, please, I don't have the time this afternoon. Please, I don't have the time. Ibe, bring the money. Give me money, oh. Give me money. I've been hungry since money. Give me money. Ngozi, leave the way, let me pass. You're not entering this house. Ngozi, leave the way, let me pass. Ibe, this house will not contain... Ibe, Ibe, this house will not contain both of us today. What is wrong with you now? Ngozi, what's, what's all this? Give me money. I did not beg you to come and marry me. What? You cannot carry me all the way from my father's house and come and be maltreating me and be suffering me. Okay, Give me, me money. Eat me up now. Okay. Eat me up. What's the meaning of all this now? Ngozi, let me go. Let me go. Give me. Ibe, Ibe, you're beating me up. Ibe, is beating me up. Ibe, is beating me up. So tell me, how did it go with the railway corporation? Any luck? No. Nope. They denied me audience as usual. Hmm. Too bad. You know, that is how it has been for over four months now. And I'm forced to live with it. Hmm, that is bad. Yeah, I've been meaning to ask. Are you from this village? No, I'm from the neighboring village. But I live close to the boundary. So my house is very close to this place. That reminds me. What about your parents and your siblings? You don't seem to talk about them at all. My parents are late. What? Yes. They died in an automoto accident with my only brother two years ago. It's just me. So sorry. Please accept my heartfelt sympathy. It's fine. Thank you. But you don't look like someone that has lost her family. How do you manage to be this strong? Yeah, you're right. Mm, I've gone past it. Life goes on. Oh. I try to pick the pieces of my life and move on. But my uncle has been so supportive. Okay. But still, I still have to be strong. True. And, you know, move on with my life. And that is what I want you to do with your life. As you can see, I'm better than yesterday. Mm. I can see. It? Obviously. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm happy that you're smiling today. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah. I have to stop here. Okay. You know I left my shop open. Yes, that's true. Uh, you've really tried. Thank you for everything, my good friend. I really appreciate it. You're always welcome. <laughs> I think you have to go now. It's yes. getting dark. Yes, yes, yes. I'll check up on you anytime soon. Okay? Alright. Thank yeah. you. Bye. Bye-bye. Yay! Yeah, 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 I am I am still trying to understand why you called me out here by this hour of the night. What is it now? Eh? But I have said everything now, haven't I? You have said nothing. As far as I'm concerned, you have said absolutely nothing. So you want me to believe that you brought me all the way from my father's house. And just within how many months of marriage, you can no longer perform your duties and take care of me as you used to do. And you want me to understand that? Eh? You just said as I used to. 
That means I was doing my job as a husband. Hmm. Not until I was unceremoniously dismissed from my workplace. And so, not until I was ceremoniously dismissed from my workplace all the time. And so, so I should live in the past and die of hunger. Is that what you're saying? Ngozi, all I'm saying is that you should be patient. Everything will be fine. See, all I need from you now is, is your support at this difficult time. Okay, take for example now. For about four months now, four months, you have refused me to touch you. How are we supposed to stay together, live together as a couple? <laughs> Ibe, now I see the main reason behind this meeting. Ibe, you are shameless. You are very shameless. Wait till. So you will shamelessly make love to me on an empty stomach. Eh? Ha! See, let me tell you something. You will not have the right to touch me until you start performing your duties as the man of the house. Good night. Where's my food? There is no food. Ngozi, your husband is not feeling fine. I went out there to get some drugs. Coming back now, you are eating the remaining food in the house. How do you expect me to take my drugs without eating? Ibe, your wife has not eaten since how many years now? And you expect me to leave the remaining food in the house for you simply because you want to take medication. Only a selfish and a foolish man will think like that. Because what's wrong with you now? What's wrong with you? Okay, how do you expect me to, to, to take these drugs now? Ah. What am I going to do now? The chemist warned that I should eat well before taking the pills. But how do I find something to eat now? I don't have any money on me. And my brother is not yet back since he traveled. I can't go borrowing either because I'm yet to pay back the ones I borrowed from people. I don't have money so it could be worse if the sickness is deep into my body. I think I have to do it. What is wrong? Why are you like this? What's going on? I... I... Oh, ju just hold on. Let me take you inside. Okay? Just come. Now that you've taken the drugs, I think you need to lie down and rest. That is, if you can. Thank you, but I need to leave now. My... Nothing will happen to you. Just rest. You can leave when you're much better. Come on, I don't bite. Is that a yes? Okay, let me do this.
<sighs> You're awake. Yes. How do you feel now? Much better. Mm. Uh, Did you uh, What's it by the time now? Oh, it should be past one o'clock. What? Please, I, 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 I want to start going now. Are you sure? sure? Yes, yes. I have to go now. Are you sure? Yes, yes. But don't you think you need to rest a little? No, I'm better now. I need to go now. Uh, okay, let me see you. Okay, uh, thank you. Fighting cannot serve this situation if I can go. Quarreling cannot serve this situation if I can go. It's only love if I can go. Only love if I can go. It's only love if I can go. Only love. But keep your distance from people who we never and we they are Cause they will always try to make it feel like it's only your fault. To 